today is, and today is August 10. Now, the reason why it's 9.35, we actually did the live event, but there's a delay that uh, it kind of didn't start broadcasting, but we did it on the other camera. A few parts I had to take out from because of the delay part. But anyways, it's 9.35. I'm sorry, I'm sorry about the delay thing. So anyways, well, I'm going to be talking about lots of awesome things. Unbox, no, 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 not unboxing. Explain accessories, new Beyblade stuff that's going to be coming out. Uh, explain about awesome Beyblades like Zero G, Custom Bays, and plus more! So I'm going to start off with our Beyblade trip from Japan. It's gonna, It was pretty great. It was a 13-hour flight to come there and 12-hour flight to get back. It was pretty worth it, and we took a bus to get to the hotel. Bus? We did? Okay, whatever. So also, I'm going to talk about the parts from the trip. Like for the Pokemon Center. It was pretty cool. We couldn't get the game because it wasn't compatible with the American version. So we bought a 3DS that so was Japanese. And we bought the game. Well, two versions of it. It was pretty cool. I even got a few plushies there. Plushies. Whatever. And, of course, my favorite part of that trip was meeting Akira Sadi, my bay idol. It was awesome. The box that he gave me was really cool. It had so many limited bay lights and a few you can't really get because it's pretty awesome. Pretty rare. And also, my favorite Beyblade that he gave to me was uh, the AD Special. It's Basel Rujian, and he painted it. The face was pretty cool. It's an 80 special. It's pretty awesome. He also gave me limited, excuse me, limited base stickers that are Oh, man, I could use the base stickers on another Beyblade. That's fine. So, that was pretty cool. I mean, Akira's daddy, he's number one blader in YouTube. Number one. No one can be better than Akira's. So, check. Okay, now I'd like to remind you about the Beyblade 13,000. It's worth right, right? 13,000 subscribers giveaway. We're going to be doing the draw tomorrow. And it's going to be really quick because I don't want to tell you. Wink, wink. I should have done the wink instead of saying it. Okay, so let me see. Oh, yeah, we'll also be announcing a new giveaway. I can't tell what it's going to be about. It's just going to be awesome. No hints. Okay, that was a hint. Okay. Okay, so let me see. Oh! As we move into this side, well, I'm going to be explaining to you the awesome Beyblade Dark Knight Dragoon! I'm going to show you the poster first. Here's the poster. That's the camera stopping because we recorded that thing. I'm sorry! Okay, so here's the poster, and I can finally show without me doing this. <coughs> Okay, so here's the poster. The, it shows Dark Knight Dragoon with the blader and the spear. It's kind of here. This has a really strong resemblance for every version of El Drago. Now from the back... Okay, let me just see for a second. Okay, This part here shows uh, two Beyblades that are pretty awesome in their fight. It's Flash Sagittario and Sir, uh, Samurai Alfred. Now, before we, uh, we did a review of that poster, it was like this one, except it was like this size. It didn't show the CF part because that was a mystery. Mystery solved. Okay, I'm just sorry because I need to look at it to show you. Okay, yeah, for the second part of here, it shows the Samurai Eifert against Sam. I mean, Shinobi Saramanda. In the top type state, it's pretty cool. And it's going to be pretty cool. It also shows the elements. There's fire, wind, and water. For fire, there's Samurai Eifert. Shinobi Saramanda and Thief Fennec. For, thank you. Now I can look and show you. For the water, they have got a, a little bit up. Okay, is it catching it? Oh, yeah. That's the Plasticaria part. Okay, can we just go a little bit down? No, I mean up. This part. You. Okay, so I said Samurai for it. Shinobi Saramanda and Thief Fennec. For water, we got Guardian Revisor. Pirates Orjo and the uh, Pirates Killarkin. Now for wind, right here. We've got the newest one, which is Dark Knight Dragoon. 
We've also gotten a Archer Gargoyle SA165 WSF, and we also got a Archer Brick C145S. So I'm gonna be explaining the Beyblade and probably a battle of it. So, uh, man, I put in this mode. See, I'm gonna have to change it because of the dumb delay. Why did that have to happen? Or I can just take it apart and show you. It's easier for me. So I can show you each part by part. So right here, yes here, this is the part that, the, the first part, it got the design from Lightning El Drago to make this. Ah, sorry, it's my accent, sorry, sorry, sorry. I guess a little bit of El Drago destroyed to touch it, and Meteor El Drago to add it onto the design. Now I'm gonna move to the face. Now this is actually, I think every design of El Drago put into here, but Zero G style. Now, for this, it was taken by Samurai Eye Fred, and it was reversed. It was, the first design was from Meteor El Drago, LW. So, and also for Pegasus, it was for Samurai Eye Fred. You know, this actually has a lot to do with Storm Pegasus. And the, the whole Zero G series is actually from Storm Pegasus. I'm serious. And other Zero G series. So here's the big complete. We'll be also doing a. Sorry. Closer. Here's the Beyblade complete. Beyblade's Dark Knight Dragoon. Pretty cool. It's a left Beyblade. That's the first AOG Beyblade that has ever left. So we're going to be doing a small battle. See, then cover the paper. I chipped on. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna do three to five rounds. So now round one. Wait, are we gonna publish the other video that we did? Okay, so people that are watching Wow. Thank you for making the people that are watching, I'm sorry about that. I didn't know that I didn't wasn't recording. So you're gonna have to see this isn't a complete video, but for the other one. Should I just say it? Because I'm going to have to say it. We did unboxing the Zero G vo Volume 2. It was this one. It was Garden Gargoyle M145 SB. Here's the Beyblade. Stickers. M145 SB. can't believe it. The score's 1 0. So now, round 2. Dark Knight? Dragon? Whoa! That was pretty cool! It was like. Epic. Epic. The score's now 2 0. So now, so now round 3. You know, that kind of makes the same sound whenever it's gone. Thank you for wrapping this thing. This, thank you, El Drago, for making this faster. The score's now 2 0. 3. Whatever. 2 0. Round 3. Yeah. It kind of hit, well, it hit the part that the camera it was holding on. Yeah. Oh, God, is it okay? No, no, no. Okay. So, Old Drago is the winner. And while I examine this base, Tip. Well, tip is falling. A little bit of ground hit on it. Scores now 3 0, so now round 4. Okay, no more rounds. I mean, this is just humiliating for the Beyblade. This is. Okay, so let me see what else. Oh, talk about the box? Oh, I forgot. Yeah, for the sneak preview, you can win Dark Knight Dragoon. This is a pretty good Beyblade to win. I mean, this Beyblade's left, and if you're like a blader who wants to have strong Beyblades, this is a Beyblade that can help you a lot. Closer. Now, there's also a combination in if you have Archer Gargoyle. Here. Down, or facing upward. Like this? Thank you. You don't need to talk. People are hearing this. Okay. Pretty cool. Okay. 
Okay. Talk about Dark Magic. Go check. Preview check. Check because we because of the delay. Okay, now we're gonna have to move on to the accessories. Accessories. Here's the combiner. I think it's combiner. Grip. Now, uh, this can hold up to three Beyblades. You can also hold up to four Ds. Now, uh, this is pretty cool. Mm, not too much of a design on it, but you can. It can hold up to with Ripcorn launchers, string launchers, and L launchers. I think I might hold up to zero G launchers. Eh, probably can't. Or can. We'll see. But it can't connect. It cannot. I repeat, it cannot connect to a, la a launcher grip because there's no parts to connect from it. So we're going to be moving on to, yes, the metal stone faces. Now we got the blue metal stone face. We got tables removed. The blue metal stone face. The blue metal stone face is right here. Now you can make it into four combinations. One that's for like the top is complete metal. The one that's only in the inner side, metal. Or the outside is metal for number three and four, complete plastic. Here, if it's too close, sorry. Can't really see. Okay. Eh, sorry. Moon accessories there. So, for our second one, we got the red milestone face. Now, I used it for Dark Knight Dragoon, if you didn't notice. Pretty cool. Now, the red is my favorite, red is one of my favorite colors. It's pretty cool. Awesome. This can help you a lot. Okay, this can help you a lot for the balance of the Beyblade and more parts. Closer? Too close? Zero G with milestone face? Okay. So next part. What is my favorite part? Zinkin's custom face. Yes, yes, people, this is Zinkin's custom day parts. Now for starters, we have got the Lightning L Drago, which is from the Super Vortex Stadium, with a 90. 90. Oh, stadium? Closer? Okay. With a tip of F. And attack type, I got inspired by this from the Golden El Drago from the Starter series. Or, whatever series it's called at least. I don't really know. Now I'll be launching it. In three, two, one. Circling pretty well. Contained from two modes. Strength would be pretty good. Stop it, or, no, it's good, good. Now, it's a red metal face, that makes it look pretty cool. Now, my idea, I was thinking of using Akira's uh, sticker part, you know, the random stickers, because there's one for El Drago, and I could have put it on, on that one, because that's what I was thinking, but I can't use anything that's in the Akira's box. Or maybe I can just get them, maybe I'll be lucky. Get the Akira's body box with stickers on it? Show the box. Oh, show the stickers! Show the bo box? Hey, here's the box. I don't get so special about it. Oh, of course I know what's special about it. There's like the Pegasus, the Galaxy Pegasus face, the bronze, the silver, the gold. The Orso, the Libra. Hey, here's the stickers I was talking about. Huh? I'm oh, good, here's the stickers. Put it back. You could have told me. Sheesh. Some cameraman's today. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to show more custom base than a carrot daddy's box. So, for our next big lead. What was that? Cam okay, we're good. We got a Dark Flames. I, I call it a Dark Flames. I just The original was applied by the W. I mean, the Wii game. Now this is, uh, has this part from Burn Sagittario, the C-145, 
Oh yeah, I forgot this launch. Yeah, I think I just basically survived because the bottom part for the tip that holds it kind of broke. I was able to put it on. Just launch. Three, two, one. Let it rip! Now this thing has good stamina plus the metal wheels power. Oh. Pretty strong Beyblades. Don't know I'm going to stop it. Okay. So now we got Inferno Fixies. This Beyblade was just to upgrade its power and to make. Flying Bixies look awesome! With a T21230 eh, WD. Now, this is pretty gonna be an epic Beyblade. I'm not sure what type it is, but it's with a metal face. We cannot put the face sticker on. Don't ask why. Here is the showing it. Oh my god, I forgot to show the other base. I'm sure they won't notice. Maybe they will. That's launch. That's launch. I think this is maybe the same Vixies, just with more power. Maybe it's in the defense now, probably. Okay. Now, speaking of defense, we got Zinke's number one creation. Today, that is... Rock Leon! This was taken from Country Leon, Thunder Leon, Rock Giraffe, or in Japan, they call it Rock Giraffe. Now, this was from Volcano Roosius and the original... No Rock Leon. If you're wondering why, when Zinke saw that WBBA book, he thought, hey, Rock Leon's good. Why don't I make a better version of it? Oh, the colors, at least. Eh, get it. His real words. So, here's Rock Leon. Pretty awesome. Now, it is. Closer? Okay. So, it's the same Rock Leon, just in looks a little bit more cooler. Now, I'm thinking maybe, just maybe, any custom base that I use, I might use it in a battle. Like, this is live. Live things only come almost once in a lifetime. That's actually true. But you can see it because we recorded on YouTube. Well, well, we recorded with the camera. Why does the delay have to happen? Okay. Now, I don't want to make this too long. So... Well, here's the two quads of the stadium. Here's the two quads of quotos. Here they are. The designs have really changed for it. It's pretty good Beyblade. I'm actually thinking that we might do battle against these two. Can we do one right now or no? Yeah? Yes! It just looks an SW. I'm not sure there's going to be much of a difference. Could I could take a look at it. Closer? What? Oh, you need to handle it. Closer. You can stay closer. So, three to five rounds. So now. Round one. Whoa. I'm going to try that again without it getting the thing on top of it. Whoa! That quarter quarter is strong! I mean, oh, that quarter quarter is strong! Circling. Quarter quarter is circling. So, starting off pretty good. Now, it looks like that gets quarter quarter isn't doing so well to the other quarter quarter. Or should I say, I'm just going to go with SQ, which I'm for starter quarter quarter, with DQ. Okay. This hit. I think it's going to hit the Beyblade now. But look how the weight stops. Pretty cool. So the score's now 1-0. Yeah. So now for round two. Oh, 
Whoa! One attack, boom! Sending it back. Yeah, that rhymes. That's pretty cool. Circling. Yes, sir. Okay. Now I'm gonna wait. Oh. Okay. One more, and then that's it. Okay. Death scores now one more, so the final round. Okay, let's make this quick and angle shots. Whoa! Whoa! Now let's see what just happened. Except, and Zanky's version of slow motion. Just give me a second to stretch. Okay. Well, the bear already won. So I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and move the camera up. Okay, so tell me if it's okay. Down? Okay, you just handle it. I'm not good at this techno thingies. Yes, I got thingies. Okay, so now we're gonna move to the final part, saying the new releases. Now for zero G, the first thing is going to be we're gonna be making a zero G string launcher. So it's gonna be upgraded with zero G. So it's gonna be more easier to launch Beyblades. If they did, it's gonna be pretty awesome. The color will be the first color. It's gonna be blue. So it might be. Oh yeah, there's gonna be the balance type stadium. It only has two holes. Now it's gonna be pretty cool. I think a Samurai iPhone's gonna have a big advantage. Well, attack types. Actually, more Jack than Chagoon. Okay, let's see. There's Bandit Golem. It's a pretty cool Beyblade. I think it's a balance or defense. It has a BS and I think the spirit's a rock, like a rock kind of, kind of like a rock creature. And the lighter kind of looks the same, except it's not a creature, it's a human. So, is that all of it? Let me think. Well, I think that's pretty much it, isn't it? Oh yeah, Kirisani's box. Forgot. So what am I going to show about it? I already showed in the video. The stickers? Everything. Everything? Okay, you don't have to say it out loud. So I'm going to show you everything in this box. They've got the Galaxy Pegasus face. It's green. Closer. Sorry, sorry, sorry. they got the Galaxy Pegasus face. It is green. Sorry. Now this one, I think would be a good idea to use with the black hole pick. I think it would be good for the, sorry, the black hole Pegasus, because it is pretty strong. I mean, pretty awesome. Okay, my this was glow in the dark. That would be cool. God, shoot. Where did my bear blade go? Oh, there it is. Thanks, glow in the dark. You know, it would be kind of cool to have a glow in the dark Beyblade. Wouldn't that be cool? Okay, so then we got the WBBA bra. I said WBBA. Okay. Bronze face. Now this has a this is pretty good color for it. And you should use that for the fall. Now we got the W oh our back is this. We got the WBBA silver face. That would be good for the winter. It is pretty good design of it. Finally we got the WBBA gold face. And it's kind of like a crown. That'd be perfect for the summer, I guess. Now there is a zero G light launcher. Oh, I can explain it now. Now for the string, it's gonna be a little bit two, two there, and like one there, and another one of there and there. Now it's gonna be like this. I'll show you. It'll be a string. Oh, except it's gonna be like this. It's gonna be a good idea. I'm saying that's a pretty good idea to do it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Putting up there, and I'm gonna lift it up. I'm not sure if it's gonna work. So we got now I'm gonna go through these Betty stickers. Now this these stickers, this sticker I wanted to use on this Bailey, but unfortunately I can't. It's for like this. 
No, it's pretty cool. I was thinking of using it on this Beyblade, but I can't. I really wanted to use it on this Beyblade. Excuse me. Burp inside again. No, here's a Libra. It kind of it kind of shows like sonic vibrations. It would explain it. It's pretty cool. Let me. It is gonna be pretty cool. It kind of looks like a disco one. So, I'm gonna put them on there. We got both. This uh, it, the few of the stickers have a little bit to links related. A little bit to be exact. Now stickers are really flashing. Would be a good idea for Dark Bowl. Yeah, of course it would be. It's match the base. Like for these stickers, it like perfectly matches the base. Any part for the that place is gonna be fit with the stickers. Now this one's also really cool. It's a Storm Pegasus, like a do not enter, except it's a Storm Pegasus. It really shows like really awesome. It's like Galaxy Nova, which shows how Pegasus is doing it. This is awesome stickers. Stickers, sorry. Now we got Rock Orso. This is really awesome. This one's one of my favorites. One of them. Yeah, it's one of them. Okay. The best. We got a WBB, we got two Bay cards with all the level stickers. It's going to be pretty cool. That's all the levels. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That could keep the balance. Oh, there's more stickers. Forgot. As in, keep the balance on there. There's also this one, which is Libra. This actually would be cool if it were with Thunder Libra. That would be cool. Now, this one is a Ray... Unicorn one? This is a pretty big sticker. I don't know what to put it on. It doesn't say. I think it means, I don't know, means, put it in. I don't know what it is for, because it's a really big sticker. I mean, look at it. Maybe it's for a giant Beyblade. Maybe they'll invent it from this size. No, dude, that's a meant to be a really big stadium then. Hmm. There's also a different kind of rock or so sticker. This one's kind of awesome. It's kind of related to the Storm Pegasus one. They got a bull one, dark bull. It's almost the same like the different bull. Now this one's for a digital launcher, Pegasus one. Not too much. Design for it. Now, here's AD special. It's awesome. Huh? Um, sorry. Just keep on looking at the Beyblade. Okay, now I'm gonna put it back. We got Black Hole Pegasus. Four. Up. Keep on looking at it. Okay. Now we got Fang Leon Burning Claw version. That's pretty cool, and I'm gonna flip it. It's a W105 uh, and R2F. This is actually a really good idea for Fang Leon. It's called Burning Claw version because of the attack power that got more increased. Put that down now. If I can first assemble all of this, maybe put a sticker from those. That was meant for. Just put the stickers in there so it's more easier for me. This will just take a second. Sorry. I'm just putting in the stickers. Now, we got the three Mercury Anubises. I'm going to show one by one. I don't know what version is. And I hear I'm showing it right. If I am. So I'm gonna put it up closer. Give me just give me a second. This guy. Okay, and I'm gonna put that one down.
this one. I'm gonna show these two to be exact. Yeah. Well, sir, let me just grab my balance for them. Here. Higher. Can't put them high. Good. Okay, I can't put any more closer. I'm. Um, Fine. <laughs> oh wait, I just realized something. Can I say it now? It kind of helped me. You know, Dark Knight Dragoon's face. It was took by Omega Dragonus. Okay. Uh. Good. Sorry, it's kind of hard. Okay, I'm gonna put that back now. It's kind of hard to do all of this. And I never want to do a repeat of a live event, like doing it again. Like, repeating the same thing I just did today. I'm sorry for the light. I'm sorry. We didn't know, but we're going to... I'm just going to tell you this, so we'll, we'll just remember. So, people, can you do me a favor? Just please tell me if it's not recording, if it's recording. But we didn't know, and I'm sorry. So you're going to have to check out the other live event that we're going to be publishing on YouTube. So I'm just going to wrap this up because it's already been really late now. 10 something, right? Okay. So Eddie, it has it. I'm has it. Hey, I has it. Okay. So please make sure you like this video. You like this live event. Make this live event your favorite. And share this live event. Please subscribe and thank you for watching our third live event. Bye. Thanks for watching. See you later. Have a great day. Or the night. Or morning. Or at every time it is at your place. See ya.